Cleveland. Gary helping out, blocking at his fullback position. Draw to the deep man, Leonard Conley. Straight ahead he goes. You know, folks earlier said, Kevin, well, Jimmy Johnson has all of Howard. Two minutes remaining, first quarter, as Cleveland Gary is taken down by Ron Sancho. In August of 87, Sancho was quoted as saying, we need a leader on the defensive line. That was prior to his junior season. I'd say he's filled that role the last two years. And he had help on that play from Phillips, the middle goal. Anything could happen to the football at this point. Gain of three. This is Crowell again. Obviously, the sophomore out of Atlanta, a very intelligent young man who's an architecture major, is good at holding on to the football, so Jimmy Johnson sneaks him into the game at this point. They've called LSU, of course, the dirtiest, the ugliest. I don't mean dirty in terms of dirty play, but the nastiest team ever to win the Southeast Conference. And I don't mean nasty in terms of nasty. Ron Sancho, they say he's got an ugly body, and he's going to be soaking wet. What I mean by is this is a team that wins ugly by all those tuned in. The score is really field position more than anything. They can get a first down without scoring. Finally inside the five, Ron Sancho. The 6'2", 230 senior out of Avondale, Louisiana, meeting him there. Miami coaches felt that the Tiger deep Soccer, it's a header. First down, Miami. A little short pass up the middle. Nothing doing there for Fred Highsmith. On the play, defending Ron Sancho along with Mark Boutte. to Randy Bethel, the tight end. Bethel, a 6-3-2 field position. Mm -hmm. Leonard Conley on the carry. Ron Sancho on the tackle. Sancho and Hill. Sancho, a much celebrated defensive player. An honorable mention All-American as a junior, second team All-SEC, and he had nine sacks. He's the team leader in sacks again this year. Out of Avondale, Louisiana, Sancho, a 6'2", 230 senior. And they couldn't get it for the spot. With it is Tim Corral, who's the punter. Louisiana State picks it up, and the Tigers have the football out at the 24-yard line. Mike Merla all over it. And Miami makes a mistake on the kicking game. Jimmy Young with pressure on the play. Well, I told you earlier, I don't know if I did such a good job of it, but the criticism of LSU this year is that they win ugly. Everything's ugly tonight. The ball is loose, and here they go. And Sancho appears to be in the middle of just about everything. So Jimmy Young, the one that knocked the football away. The Notre Dame. If they win against USC, we'll continue in a minute. First down, pass right side. And that one is over on the right for Tracy Waiters. Waiters, a fullback. 